This tiny golden aura is the grace of the Erd Tree. This light once shone in the eyes of your tarnished brethren, but now it is all that guides you. Also, I hear you can see them, can't you? The rays of grace that guide you through your burden. Upon the cliff in Castle Stormvale is a shard bearer, a demigod, who inherited a fragment of the shattered Elden Ring. If the rays of grace signal the castle, then the Elden Ring beckons you. As an ally by pact, I pray that you are fit to face the challenge presented by the ring. Upon the cliff, in Castle Storm, a demigod, if the rays and the Elden as an ally pray to face the ch- Foul tarnished. In search of the Elden Ring. Emboldened by the flame of ambition. Forgive me. I've been testing you to see whether or not Grace truly does guide you, and whether you are fit to face the challenge that entails. It seems my worries were unfounded. Torrent had your measure from the very start, whereas I merely pretended. There is but one other thing I can do to offer you guidance. I can take you to the round table hole gathering place of tarnished champions, guided by grace. Very well, let my hand rest upon you for but a moment. I see you've just arrived. Welcome to the Round Table Hold. I'm Corin, a man of the cloth. I teach incantations, the strength granted us by the two fingers, and explore the secrets of the Golden Order, so that one day, if a tarnished of the Round Table Hold should become Elden Lord, I might counsel them, ensuring order regains its proper form, writing rule over men. By the way, do you still see it? 
the guidance of grace. You do? Wonderful news. Most tarnished are blind to it these days. You are something of a rare breed. Well, what do you say? Care to learn an incantation of the two fingers? May the golden order shine through you. Oh, this is a rare occasion. I can't remember the last time a new tarnished made their way to the round table. Very well. As your senior, I bid you welcome. It is safe here. You may let down your guard. Allow me a word of advice. As your senior, you are a mere visitor to the round table. Nothing more. A house guest. Yet to earn their keep. Remember your place, newcomer. There's nothing left to say. Be at your leisure. I'm... well, just call me Dialos. The honor of one's house holds little import in these lands. By the way, have you met a young woman named Lanya on your travels? She's my servant. But fickle as the wind. Take your eyes off her for but a moment and she's good as gone. If you find her, please be sure to tell me. Your new face. No matter. It's all the same. Lay out your arms. Let's get smithing. I see you've noticed the chains. Nothing special. I'm a prisoner and these are my chains. I'm trapped by the hold. I'm dying, smithing for you fools. <laughs> That's all there is to it. No, don't leave too much into it. I have no grudge against you. My being a prisoner is no fault of yours. Besides, I don't mind smithing. Despite my differences, the weapons get stronger all the same. Even time. Technique never fails. Besides, it helps me forget. The sheer terror of her. Greetings, great champion called by grace. I am fear. Circumstances have compelled my stay at the round table hold. Great champion, would you allow me to hold you? But briefly, perhaps you might share with me some of your lively vigor and your stout heartedness. Doing so will grant me the warmth of a champion. And you, I am sure, will bear a Balderkin's blessing. Do you think it vulgar, perhaps? Where I come from, it is a sacred act. Ah, oh, my thanks, great champion. You are very warm. What you felt light up inside you was a Balderkin's blessing. Though it is but a fleeting thing, I am afraid. Come back to me, should you require another. I will take you in my arms as often as you need. 